Hi everyone, my name is Steve Defaval and I'm the Product Marketing Manager for our industry leading finite element analysis software Ansys Mechanical. In this video, I'm going to go over some of our top highlights for our latest release 2024R1. When opening Ansys Mechanical 2024R1 for the first time, you will quickly notice improvements when accessing and interacting with the product. Most notably, the application now provides new interface color themes. The new dark and light themes not only enhance the aesthetic appearance of the application, but also create a consistent user experience across other ANSYS products. You can select a theme using the dialog box that automatically displays the first time you open Mechanical. In addition, you can now open ANSYS Mechanical independently from the Start menu. This standalone version of the application allows for improved efficiency when scripting, as well as providing additional flexibility for opening single model analyses and complex analyses through Workbench. To help accelerate the meshing process for complex acoustics domains, Mechanical now has a new Mesh Workflow feature. The Mesh Workflow organizes each step of the meshing process into a streamlined, customizable, and parametric workflow. A green checkmark will appear next to each step after its successful completion, with the ability to revert to any step in the workflow. At the 2024R1 release, there are three predefined acoustics meshing workflows supported, external and internal FEM acoustics, and BEM acoustics with additional workflows planned. Custom mesh workflows are available as a beta option and all workflows can be saved and exported as a template to share with others. You can now select to use the data processing framework to generate a binary file the application uses internally to map data for an imported velocity. This capability improves the time needed to map the data and create the input file. This is an improvement compared to reading and writing to and from a table in ASCII file. In addition, when you are using the DPF, you can now choose how you want to apply the imported velocity based on rotational speeds, including all steps, a single step, or manually using individual RPM sets. Now, when you are performing a harmonic acoustics analysis, a new frequency adapting mesh morphing feature is available that helps reduce solve time and memory usage and enables the user to better resolve desired frequencies. Using the morphing region object, you can create a domain in which the mesh is automatically adapted during the solution process to optimize the overall domain and mesh size based on the frequency being solved. Linking multiple ls dyna analyses is now more efficient than ever, with new multi-system linking methods to efficiently transfer data, like deformed geometry positions and stress state, between cases. Two methods for linking are available. One where all model data is shared between systems, like the example shown in the video here and a second method where the results from the first simulation are used for initialization of the following, allowing for increased flexibility like adding additional bodies and contacts in the downstream analyses. As models are becoming larger and more complex and more users are moving to remote or cloud-based computing, it's important to understand the computing resources needed to solve your simulation in the most efficient manner. Mechanical has incorporated a resource prediction feature that leverages machine learning based algorithms to predict computing resources needed before solving a model. The ML based algorithm is trained using millions of anonymous data points from previously solved simulations. In addition to solve time and memory, resource prediction now provides disk space requirements for static structural and modal analyses. The table displayed provides guidance on using existing computational resources in the most efficient manner, or if your model could benefit from a more powerful machine. Thanks for watching. Make sure to check out the links in the description to see where you can learn about even more exciting new features in 2024 R1. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to stay up to date with all things ANSYS Mechanical.